What are you working on? I'm working on some new ideas for the Foundation for Gay Rights. I'll show them to my mother later. I'll show them to my mother later. I work with my mother. I'm such a loser. <laughs> it's great that your parents are supportive. Yeah. Yeah, it is. My mom came a really long way since I came out. So did my dad. My birth father, not so much. Yeah, but the beauty is you can use the Grimaldi money to support gay rights. Yeah, and how mad would this make Damien? <laughs> There's nothing you can do about that, though, right? I mean... No, it's my money. I can do whatever I want with it. I'm glad that all worked out. Yeah. What didn't work out, though, was, uh... It was last night. That didn't exactly go as we planned. I can't believe my roommate came home so early. Yeah, he has really bad timing. Yeah, dorms aren't exactly known for privacy. <laughs> <laughs> but I think I've got a solution. Hmm? Why don't you move in with me? Are you serious about this? You really want to move in together? Well, I have to move out in a few months anyway when the semester's over. I just figure... We could try living together this summer, you know, we'll sublet and see how it goes. <laughs> That's amazing. <laughs> I thought I'd have to wait years for you to come around. Well, maybe I'm not as logical as you thought I was. Maybe I can throw caution to the wind every once in a while, too. Or maybe you think I'm doing better now? You know, I'm getting my life back together and I'm working for the foundation. Maybe you think I'm ready to take on something else, like uh, living with you. you know, I hadn't thought about it that way, but now that you mention it, yeah, I think, I think you are ready in a way that you weren't before. So I made a few calls. Oh, I cannot wait for our first night in our new apartment together. We can just look around and be like, this is ours. This is all ours. <laughs> Me too. It's just going to be for the summer, though. Oh, no, I'm, I'm cool with that. I mean, if it turns out that you have some weird habits that I don't know about, you know, like if you snore like a buzzsaw <laughs> or if you have some strange hankering for deep dish anchovy every night at 10 p.m., I am out of there. Yeah, that's me. Well, <laughs> if you mess with my classic film collection, it's going to be you as out first, mister. Ah, no, I have a really, really good feeling about this. I'm glad you said yes, because... You know Mayor? Yeah, that's me. Oh, you must be Mr. Reese in the place at Dunbar Road, right? Oh, I, I talked to a broker, and she said this place became available, and it, it's got everything we need. Yeah? That's awesome. Yeah, and uh, this is Luke Snyder. Luke, this is Mr. Reese. Nice to meet We're you. going to be sharing the apartment. Luke, this is going to be our new landlord. But it's only a one-bedroom. Oh, that's all we need. I kind of figured you'd be cool with it, so I filled out all the paperwork. The place is a lot like the one that you found. I mean, even right down to the working fireplace. Oh, that sounds great. I don't think we're going to have many fires in the middle of summer, but... Oh, who knows? You want to stay longer? You know, if you want to check the place out first... No, I mean, if, if you say it's great... I do. Well, really? then that's all I need to hear. So we can get you any reference you need uh, from this foundation I work for. I know it sounds kind of sketchy, but it's completely legit. Yeah, and we can have, you know, first month's rent check to you immediately. Sorry, the, the apartment on Dunbar's been rented. What do you mean it's been rented? I, I just talked to the broker this morning. She said it's available. It, it, it can't be rented. Sorry, boys. Better luck next time. I can't believe that. What, what just happened? You know what just happened. See? The law is very clear. Illinois bans discrimination against gays and lesbians in housing and public accommodations. So what that landlord did to us was illegal. Yeah, but how do we prove it? I mean, if, if he said the place was already rented, well, he was lying. Obviously, but it's his word against ours. I mean, that won't hold up in court. Yeah, well, we have to do something. Maybe we can get, like, a investigation against him or something. Are you guys talking about that landlord, Sam Reese? Yeah, do you know him, Tyler? Major homophobe. He profiles his tenants and never rents to gays. The same thing happened to me and my boyfriend. Well, we can't let him get away with this. Uh, let's just forget him. Let's find another apartment. Uh, do you want the name of a broker who's a little bit more gay-friendly? Yeah. <laughs> Thanks, Tyler. Um, see, why don't we just check her website, see if she's got anything, you know, in available in our price no, range. No, we can't let this landlord get away with breaking the law. He's a jerk, Luke, I agree, but he didn't say, say anything incriminating, so what are we supposed to do about it? Well, I'm not just going to sit here and take it. Come on. Where are you going? I don't know, but we have to find some way to make this right. I was wondering when the two of you were going to move in together. Congratulations. Have you guys started looking for a place? Uh, when we're just getting to that part, uh, we hit a roadblock. Well, listen, if the rents are too high... No, no, it's not that. Have... Noah found an amazing apartment. Yeah. The landlord just won't rent it to us. How come? Because we're gay. You guy's a total creep. 
He's done this before. That's horrible. And illegal. He can't get away with that. That's what I said. Yeah, but what are we supposed to do about it? I mean, he said he rented it to somebody else. Now, of course, that's a lie, but we've got no way to prove it. It's just our word against his. Yeah, but we're totally right, and he's totally wrong. There has to be a way that we can get the message across to this landlord and others like him that what he's doing is completely illegal and won't be tolerated. No, but what are we supposed to do? I don't know. Um, stage a protest, something? I have an idea. Why don't we go public with the issue as a project for Luke's foundation? I mean, now that I've taken over as administrator, I'd be more than willing to help you on it. Seriously? Sure, why not? Uh, time out, time out. You're running the foundation. When did this happen? Uh, just the other day. I, I didn't get a chance to tell you. Luke, you said that you wanted to focus more on gay rights. I mean, this is obviously a critical issue. What do you think? I, I think it's an awesome idea. I'm... Sounds <laughs> great to me. Yeah, so how about this? How about Noah and I go do some research and, uh... Get back to you with what we have. Okay. Sounds good. And listen, if you need help with the department, just let us know. Oh, thanks, Mom. Mm -hmm. You're the best. <laughs> what? Nothing. <laughs> I think it's great that you're running the foundation. Well, why was I the last to know? Holden, are you still mad at me for... Not telling you about the new job? No. I don't think you kept me out of the loop on purpose. Must be Dusty, then, because something is bothering you. You know what? Dusty will always be a sore subject. But at least Meg is keeping her distance. I think you and me need to do the same. The last thing I want is for him to come between us again. I completely agree. So we're good, right? You know what? I'm very proud of you. You are? Why? Yeah, you're working with Luke. It's for an important cause. Pretty happy about it. You should be. He's happy, too. Seems like himself again. He's motivated. Yeah, I want to do everything I can to keep that going. Me, too. Go help out whenever I can. You will? I might take you up on that. You know, this fight isn't going to be easy. It won't, but you can do it. Just go out there and give him help. Take no prisoners. Mm. With you, I feel like I can do anything. I know you can. I know that for a fact. Look at how many states still don't have laws banning discrimination against gays and lesbians in housing and employment. Do you really think you can change all that? Well, you know, maybe we can try. At least we can get the issue some visibility. Maybe we can start petitioning online pressuring politicians to try and do the right thing. But, what, do you think I'm too charged up about all this? I think we probably need to monitor your caffeine intake. But no, I like you and you're all charged up. Okay, well, how about this? How about I keep doing research and you find us an apartment? Oh.